Now, whatever you used to call this in your previous playout system, button bars, pages, whatever, stop confusing everyone. They're now hotkeys. And this plus button will let you create a brand new page from scratch. Put in a title, how many columns and rows it has, if you want it just to live on a specific station. I've found that fewer columns and more rows are going to give you more text, more easily viewable within the square, but... You do you, boo. If you need to adjust the amount of columns or rows or title, just click here to edit. Now, say you have multiple pages, but you don't want all of your screen real estate taken up just by hotkeys. You can actually dock them to the one module, drag it until you see the middle part of this navigation icon light up, and then it'll just snap right in. Colouring the squares is easily done just like this, but to get access to all the nice, pretty bright colours, click the advanced button here. Right-clicking with your mouse will give you a whole heap of options, including the ability to delete a button by clearing it. Though watch out because there's no undo. You can actually also force a hotkey asset to be played out of a specific channel on your desk, not just the next available one like it normally does. Heads up though, this will cut off any previous audio playing currently on that channel. You can even get it to play hooks of songs rather than just the beginning by selecting hook enabled and you'll notice the time change in the square to guarantee that it's just going to be the chorus. Copying multiple assets between hotkey pages is as simple as dragging them, say, into your stacks and then moving them back onto another hotkeys. Well, that's pretty much it, though I strongly recommend you creating a small page with essential assets you need to access at a moment's notice, like winner sound effects, recurring audio gags, the current secret sound. Uh, dock that to another part of the screen so no matter what you're looking at or what hotkeys you're tabbed into, it'll always be visible and accessible.